I'm gonna attempt to stay in ice water for 10 minutes. This clip is from November 2019. That was literally the first time I went into cold water during winter. And shortly after that, I wrote on my bucket list, take an ice bath for 10 minutes. But I knew that if I want to make this happen, I have to train for it and somehow find a way to deal with the cold. So I went into the water more and more often. By the way, this is my mom. Look at how I really have to stay focused not to get cold. And she is literally just swimming around like it is nothing. I'm just so not looking forward to this. Uh, but yeah, I mean, if I want to stay in the water for 10 minutes, I have to train. I'm aware of that. Ah! Uh, it's just a roller coaster of emotions. Uh, I'm really nervous. But um, yeah, I'm gonna do some briefing exercises now just to calm myself down and. So for the last couple days, it has been below zero degrees. And I go and check if the water is frozen because I want to do the 10 minutes in frozen water. <laughs> it actually looks good. Yeah, that's definitely ice. So I actually got this thermometer so I can measure how cold the water actually is. Sure if you can see it, three degrees, something like this. Let me try to find another spot. The ice is so thick here that you can get on. I could make a hole there and get in somewhere over there, but I need something to break the ice. I might gonna give it a try right now. The ice is so thick, I can't even break through. But I mean, it's a good sign because that means I could go there and make a proper hole with like a hammer or something. And then I can go in there. All right, gonna try it here because someone already did it here. All right, so I stayed in for like three minutes. I didn't want to push it. I actually just wanted to see how it feels like going into the ice. And um, I felt good. It was not too bad. I think I could have easily done five to six minutes. I guess I'm gonna do 10 minutes in two days. Yeah, just gonna push through and finally take it off my bucket list. Whew. First of all, we need to make a hole to the ice. All right, the hole is ready. I'm gonna get warmed up a little bit. Probably gonna do some little bit of breathing and then let's hit that 10 minutes. <sighs> so I already know that the f my feet are gonna be the coldest, so I'm trying to keep them warm as long as I can. All right.
there we go. I wanted to do this for over a year now, and now it's finally time to do it. It all went well until this point, but at around minute 8 I felt how I started to kind of fade out and as you can see I quickly had to focus on my breath again before I lose control. Another item off my bucket list. Yeah. So I just had a shower and I'm warmed up again and I'm feeling great. Taking an ice bath for over 10 minutes was something that I've been thinking about since the beginning of last year. And honestly, I didn't expect that this would bring so many more benefits as well. Because of this constant battle with myself. I mean, so many times I wanted to stay in my comfort zone, but I was still able to step outside. Overall, this challenge made me so much stronger in terms of my physical, but also my mental health. As always, thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that like button and also let me know in the comments if you have any other ideas for a challenge, because I'm looking to do more challenges like this. So yeah, I'll see you next time.